1990 Lincoln Town Car was built for the person looking for quality, class, beauty, performance, and luxury. Welcome to April's Garage, the greatest automotive channel in all of the land. And it's the greatest because I make fantastic purchases like this 1991 town car. It is glorious, 40,000 miles now. It's the greatest channel, of course, because I make incredible purchases based solely off one key criteria, this beautiful color. What do you think, Tyler? Silver metallic rosé. It is lovely. I've owned a few of these. One was $500, the other one was $2,000. This one was a lot, lot more. But a little bit more than your normal purchase for you, but for me, I like, I like quality, and this is quality. Well, there's one of two ways to buy things. You buy them cheap, and then you spend way too much fixing them, and then they're worth about half of what you have into it. Or you start with a really nice example, <laughs> and it continues to be a very nice example. And uh, yeah, you, if you don't have a YouTube channel to where your bad decisions are rewarded, so it makes a lot of sense. But uh, mm -hmm. yeah, the G-Wagon is down with the uh, cylinder scoring and the oil consumption, so you said you wanted a big boat. This is a big boat that sways. I feel like I might need some um, Dramamine when I'm driving it, because around the turns, it just kind of like floats like you're in the water, like you're in a boat. I'm gonna have motion sickness. But you said that you saw this and you liked it and you wanted it, <laughs> and then you bought it, and I'm just still having a hard time believing that you are a real person, because <laughs> I'm a boring. big land yacht lover, so this yes. was right in my wheelhouse, and the fact that you wanted it, yes. and you got it, and you're making this your daily driver, this is the perfect daily. Are you crazy? Well, it certainly was 30 years ago, but... Uh, Look at that. And you can even hold me up. Daily driver and uh, a nap time area right here. This is perfect. I'm getting a little held up, too. Um, well, should we start the tour of it? This is usually the part where we start the tour, April. Um, but, yeah, you can keep lounging like that all you want. I don't want to move. This is why land yachts are amazing, because you can lay on them very comfortably. Yeah. There's the paint, that silver rosé metallic. It's beautiful, just like a tiny little metal flake in it. It's gorgeous and so comfortable. <laughs> well, my friend Anthony Gozo of Specialty Motor Cars would say this Lincoln has all the gingerbread. He specializes in selling these. We didn't buy it from him. We got it from Cars and Bids. Is that the Daddy Doug eyebrow raise? Did you hear me do that? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh, yeah. That was my inside voice, not staying inside. I see. <laughs> so the gingerbread is the accessory wheel arches here, the chrome there, the half vinyl top. This is really cool, actually, because I feel like if you left it outside, it would get totally beat up, but someone took care of her. Someone parked her inside, like, they treated her well. Right, normally I'm not a fan of vinyl tops, but I think the half sort of works on this one. And then I love the chrome or the steel strip here with the opera light. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Why did they feel like they needed to do like a three inch window back here? Like all of this work just for a tiny little window. It is a massive C pillar, so they needed to do something. Yeah. And this one is the signature series. Oh. Uh, that makes it, I think the middle trim level. So there would have been executive signature and Cartier. So you yeah. Not that fancy, just a little bit fancy. Not over the top. Right. Ooh, but look at that cranberry velour interior. That's a couch right there. Yep. You could fit like five friends across the whole thing. Yeah, hop in. <laughs> Glorious. Yeah, like I said, in my Jack Nicholas edition Lincoln Town Car video, it has wood from the finest plastic trees. <laughs> that one had a white seat, like a golf glove, green right. carpets. It was very weird, but it had the same digital gauges, which are very cool. Look at that. That's great. 4.6 V8. <laughs> Wire mesh wheels. Even the original factory radio. That's the original radio? Yeah, You're optional kidding. CD, isn't that cool? That does not, I totally thought this was aftermarket. You're serious? That's, that's factory. There's a CD in here? Mm hmm Do we have CDs? Is there one in here? I, I don't no, think so. There's nothing in there. But if there were a CD in there, it'd be something like Barbra Streisand or... <laughs> you think so? Yeah. Yeah, that'd be perfect. Something, something Tony like Bennett. that. Tony yeah, Tony Bennett. Yeah, Tony Bennett. Well, it's going to be... Look a female the, lounge singer, but yeah. The back seat and how comfortable that is. That's a couch. It is ridiculous. It's glorious. Got a little fold down. Uh-huh. Armrest right here. 
Glory. He's got the Lincoln emblem. Uh huh. Right in there. So fancy, of course, ashtrays all in the back seat. Oh yes, every single person would have had an ashtray. It even has its own lighter. Yes. Look at that. That's the early 90s for a gangster's car. This is sort of the last generation of that. The Panther platform retired in uh, 2011 or 12, I believe. This is great. Yeah, it is really, really cool. And I cannot believe this is what you wanted to cruise around yes. in. This is the perfect daily. She's ridiculous. This is amazing. But it did show up with one problem. <laughs> uh, when you turn on the AC or switch it to heat, right. it makes this banging noise in the dash. So. Right. We do need to take it up to the car wizard to get it looked at. I told the seller about it and he said that he would take care of it and pay for it because he didn't disclose the issue. And said the AC work and the AC unfortunately doesn't work. So he's going to take care of both of those for us. So very nice there. Got but these rear tilting seats mm -hmm. that I, oh, I got to pull that up oh, so it works. That's falling down. Okay. But so it is a bit of a hoopty. Is incredible because the seats like tilt back so you can just lean way back and it's so comfortable. Well, should we take her for a cruise up to the Wizards? Oh, yeah, I think we need to. Oh, she is a boat. Very much old school luxury right here. Yes, they're gonna think I'm so cool. Oh, nice. <laughs> like, who is that luxurious queen driving? Ooh, they, he gave me the finger, what does that mean? A wave, I think, oh, yes. A, a one finger, pointer finger yeah. wave. Yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know what that means. It's means something weird. I love how everything's cranberry. Like the door handles, the steering wheel, the carpet, the seats, everything. Like every little detail is cranberry. Yeah, they certainly don't do that with interiors anymore. They are gray, tan, or black. Yeah. They don't do fancy colors. Too. And this old school ride, this soft, pillowy ride where this thing could never handle or take a turn to save its life, but the ride is so incredible. The rear air ride. Oh. Oh you gonna do this with me? The noise, the ho <laughs> yep. It feels so good. It's so mm -hmm. smooth. It's like butter driving. So is this the silencer? Oh, this is great. I love the digital readout too. Yes. That was really cool when those first came out. Now they look so dated. You can cycle through. This was cutting edge tech. 66 degrees, 15.8, average Whoa. MPG. you do why would you buy something like this oh no wizard loves land yachts as well so i'm sure he's going to be happy and surprised that it's not a complete and utter turd but <laughs> as far as things to break there is not a lot on these old lincolns the air rides will pop sometimes in the rear uh i think like the valve seals will go and it'll smoke a little bit Wait, obviously this smoke. one's not smoking but okay. they're pretty darn invincible there's not i mean there's i guess power memory seats and the climate control's clicking, but yeah, you flooring it? There we go. I feel that power? <laughs> the power of luxury. It is adequate, I, I would wanna, say. I don't want to get pulled over. You can't sense. You're going the speed limit. It is adequate power. This is a car that cops don't pull over because they're like, oh, just let them go. <laughs> it's not worth it. They're going to be very surprised to see April Rose and not uh, a blue haired woman. Right. It's April Rose and Silver Rose. Yeah. Beautiful. I feel very sophisticated all of a sudden. Mm hmm. I need to put my pinkies up when I drive. Right. Mm, very fancy. For the 90s. Very, very fancy. I don't think they made a lot of Silver Rose uh, Lincoln Town cars because I've never seen them. Never, one. ever. Absolutely. But I do love the idea of a boat. Yes. And this color. Is pretty. I would own a car with this color. It's just, just being a man, I think it's <laughs> it's pretty. I love these weird teals and floral right. kind of colors. So yeah, very nice work. I'm not going straight because that's dirt road. No, it's no. Just gonna get all dirty. Head right, okay. and that'll point us due north to the car wizards. Oh, right. And you're gonna do your first ever car wizard inspection. I'm nervous. He's so like professional. <laughs> I think he really knows his stuff. He's gonna be like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Just a little click. Wizard! Uh, you're not hooping. 
This is what I look like with makeup on. <laughs> How's it going, April? Look at my new baby. Isn't she beautiful? That's not silver, is it? It is silver rosé metallic. Silver rosé metallic? With a slight cherry pinstripe. Or cranberry, would you say, down the side. That makes it extra elegant. This thing's amazing. I, that's what I thought, right? So, like... What's wrong with it? Obviously, something's wrong with this. This is Hoobie's garage. So. <laughs> well, no, you can look at me. I'm still here. Well, but yeah, here. April's leading the show. <laughs> yeah, I know. This, is, this is my baby. She like clicks a little bit when the air conditioning and the heat comes on. Wow, this thing is so cool. Isn't it comfortable? It's like peak 90. What is this? A 91? 91. Oh, wow. This should be like living room furniture. That's the wrong key. Hold on. I'll get it in one in three tries. Right. It's behaving for wizard. Why? It's a, it's scared it's not of doing you. it. It's it was doing it all the time before. Bang, bang, bang! I can yeah. show you the video, but now it's not. Well, the, on these, there's really only one motor actuator. It's just for the temperature. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's way deep inside the dash. It's a dash out job. So there it goes. Yes. I heard it. You heard that click. Yeah, let's so try it again. Normally it just continues to click over and over. So those are the little teeth inside of it just going click, 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 click. I feel like she's, there. yeah, she's. There, there it is. There it's the temperature, go. yeah. So that's like something you have to take the whole dash out for? Yeah, so this whole thing will come out, out through the door here. It'll just be empty in here. Why is it doing that? There's little plastic teeth inside of there yeah. that should be moving the door. And instead of the door moving, it's just skipping on the teeth and breaking. Does that happen to a lot of like old 90s cars? Yeah, it's a common issue. Can you just bang it? <laughs> no, it doesn't stop. That's the really annoying part. And thankfully the seller on Cars and Bids is going to get it taken care of for us. Oh, they're paying for they're, it. They're paying, yeah. yes. Excellent, that's the mm -hmm. best way. But look at the mileage, wizard. Isn't that cool? 42,000 miles. That's an awesome digital dash. You could like sing a song, like get the tempo Ooh, set. It's like a thing. metronome. Yeah, it really is. Are you going to sing? No, I'm not going to sing. A little bit? I'm no? not a singer. I mean, like one out of ten. Is this your favorite car in the whole world? Probably a six or a seven. There's a moonroof wizard. Oh wow! <laughs> On a Lincoln Town car. It's a romance and luxury all in one. What did I do? Did you, did you break it? Oh, I think oh, you need to move it to the side. Okay. All right. And the moonroof. Functional moonroof. Oh, that's very brave that April's I was gonna using say, that. I don't ever open them. You that don't? is it's terrifying. They like break so rich, easily. Then they say, you you broke my, you know, I don't open them. Your head would get so sunburned so I better close it. All the plastic oh. gears that are inside that dash are up in there too, and they yeah. like to go. So other than the clicking, it, everything seems to be fine? Uh, for now. For now. <laughs> Let's take a look under the hood at least. Right. Do I keep it on or turn it off? You turn it off. Oh, wow. So, yeah, this is 91. This is like the first year of the 4.6 modular motor. Oh. I don't even think they had them in 90. This is like, wow, this is cool. So, is it power here is what you're saying? Um, It's not a lot of power. So, this is the beginning of an era of the Mustangs and Grand Marquis and all kinds of cars. Even trucks had okay. this motor. Before 90, you got like a 5 liter, a 302 or something. But this is awesome. You really scored with this thing, except for the, having the dash to come out. That's not fun. Right, right. That's not cheap either. Do you see any other problems? It I don't looks know. like it was well cared for. They're pretty yeah. invincible vehicles, so. I can tell it was where they would park it and disconnect the battery. And, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so it's parked a while. Well, the vinyl top is in, like, pristine condition. And really? And it would totally get ruined in the sun, so they definitely parked it underneath in a garage. Mm -hmm. Everything looks, I mean, it's even stock wires, and everything's... Intact. It's not been modified or... Wow. Untouched, would you say? Yeah, it's unmolested. Unmolested. Yeah, this is really it's a beautiful. beautiful time. It's like a time capsule. What do you think about the color? I love it. Rosé metallic. It kind of reminds me of the Mary Kay cars, like yeah. the Cadillacs that are pink. It, it's a different, though. It's a different feel. Like outside... Sorry, you can't tell me. That I can kind of see the pink now here. Would you feel comfortable driving it? Pink doesn't bother like me. Like it wouldn't pull your man card? No. Did you trim your beard? A little Ooh, bit. Oh, that's very fancy. Actually, I had surgery a while back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so <laughs> it's kind of growing back. You can cover it up 
in yeah. your beard. Yeah. What are these things down here? Those are deer whistles. What? Like, so it, what? Make, it makes a whistling noise that we can't hear. Stop it. Are you messing with me right now? No. Is, is he messing No, that's absolutely me? what it is. So the deer get out of the way. They can hear, yeah. like, it's like a noise. They're like, what the hell is really? that? Really? But we can't hear it. That that's the heard. idea. Whether they work or not, I don't know. Do you think turtles can hear it? Possibly. Because Tyler ran over a turtle not too long ago. No, I didn't. I tried to rescue it. I didn't get there. I mean, oh, it, was yeah. it was just short <laughs> of being true. in time to save it. There's a turtle. He's still alive. I gotta rescue him. Put him in the pond. Oh! That was a little late. Well, wizard, can you uh, sort out the dash for us and we can. maybe give her an oil change? Is it expensive to like remove the dash? Well, it's not for you because he, I still owe on that. The oh, GT five hundred. Yes, but the seller's yeah. paying for it, so I don't have to worry about it either. How much is it? You think it's going to cost? Oh, that's though? right. The seller's paying for it. What does it matter? It's money. Is well, money I for guess you? I have that. Yeah, yeah, you do have that. Yes. Yeah. Can that just catch on fire? Is that a thing? Maybe while I'm watching it, like, light it on fire? <laughs> I think this video is coming out before that video, but it's fine. They can have a little hint. So. Okay. All right, we'll leave it in your capable hands. It sounds like it's a pretty big job, though. It will be. Yeah. Yes. Take care of her. It's April's new baby. Be gentle. I'll try to. Be gentle. Thank you so much for watching. Now that you've had a look at the 1990 Lincoln Town Car, I invite you to visit your local Lincoln Mercury dealer and experience what a luxury car should be.